Hi, welcome to using the tools menu in a Google Doc. The first thing that we need to look at is what we can do with our tools menu. So when we click on the word tools, we're going to see that we can define, do a word count, translate our document, or choose preferences. I want to highlight just the word test, and I'm going to go up to tools and define. Now when I go into my define area, I'm going to see that it gives me synonyms and it gives me definitions and if I keep scrolling down through here I'm going to see web definitions where I could go to get more information about different types of tests etc. I can also change the language so if I wanted to find the information in German I can have that there as well and I'm going to click on close and go back to my document the next thing that I want to do is I want to highlight every, all of my words and I want to find out how many words I have in my document so I'm going to highlight it all and then click on tools and word count and once I do tools and word count it'll tell me how many pages I have in my document in my selection how many words that I have and how many characters I have as well I can close out of this and then our next stop is tools and then translate document and it'll give me a new document and I can choose which language I would like it to go into so if I choose Arabic here and choose translate you'll notice that I got a different document I have my translated copy of test and then everything is in Arabic close out of that. So now you know how to translate your document into a different language. Our last one is tools and preferences. If you've ever used autocorrect in Microsoft Word or OpenOffice or anything like that, you'll notice that this is very similar. So what I can do here, I can automatically detect hyperlinks. I can uncheck that so it doesn't automatically do the link. And then I can also choose to have my autocorrects on. So if I wanted to replace the word replace Wisconsin abbreviation with the actual word, I can do that. And when I click on OK, you'll notice that it automatically gives me the entire word Wisconsin. So that's how you would use your autocorrect. It saves you a ton of time. If you are typing the same word repeatedly, you can do a shortened version and let the computer finish it up for you. That's all that there are for tools in Google Docs. So I just want to say thank you, and I will see you next time.